This is it. The sorceress is right through here. Everyone ready? Or is it just us? I think it's just us. Anyway, here we go. And there's not even voices. Okay, so, yeah, there's no music here, so I'm gonna have to, like, manually... Well, you're, you're hearing it right now, because I manually, um, edited the music in myself, but... Yeah, on that note, this is a pretty cool final battle theme. I really like it. It's a shame that I'm not actually hearing it while fighting, uh, Blue Barney here. So what the heck am I doing? Um, in order to fight the sorceress, you have to use these cannons that drop down. Actually, the sorceress is a really, really, really easy boss. <laughs> Like, if you, if you guys were hoping the final boss would be as epic as Ripto was, well... I hate to tell you, but you're in for a disappointment. You're already at the disappointment. The Sorceress is really not that great of a boss. Granted, I'm getting hit a couple times here, but yeah. She's got nothing on Ripto. Except I, I gotta stop getting hit. <laughs> well, let's not let's not lose to this pathetic boss. She can't even be original. She stole Ripto's little electric ball attack. Also, that was unfair. That's how you fight that. I mean, that's how you get away from that. Okay. Now, I think at this point, um, Agent 9 is going to start shooting down flying saucers. Oh, yeah, there's one over there. If you can get into a saucer, then this battle's pretty much as good as one. Here we go. So, yeah, now we can fly around and just shoot at her. Ah, shoot. Of course I have to muck it up. Oh, what the heck? You tricked me. Okay, you're going down right now. I am not going to get hit anymore in this fight. Oh. What you have just witnessed in this video is confidential and shall remain so. Yeah, let's do it. This is totally my first time fighting the sorceress. I, I didn't die to her or anything before. to hit her when she's a long ways away. Really? I, 
cannot... I, okay, you know, I'm gonna be honest. I cannot believe this easy boss is giving me this much trouble. What is going on? There we go. You know, I've really got to learn not to be so cocky about things sometimes, because, uh... Seems like every time I am, I get into situations like this. I'll say if anything, though, I think the cannon part is probably the hardest part of the fight. Once you start getting the other vehicles, it's like way, way, way easier. how we do it. Ha! I hit you anyway. Got three hits on her with one vehicle. That was pretty good. Okay. Flying saucer time again. Now this time, let's do this. <laughs> You know, if Agent 9 would shoot down a saucer already... I'm waiting! Oh, there's one. Really? Well, at least the vehicle didn't disappear. I'm gonna show you that I'm not all talk, sorceress. I know how to fight you. Ah, shoot. Ah, oh, well. We got this in the bag. I just hit her like three more times. Yeah, you get away from me before I get into this thing. Ah. I, I tried to get a quick second hit on her, but her invulnerability frame stopped me. Okay, one more hit. Okay, let's end this. There! Burn! Good grief! I was not expecting the sorcerers to actually give me that much trouble. Well, that's the end. Or is it? Pyro, you've just defeated the sorceress, rescued the dragon eggs, and restored freedom to the lost dragon world. What do you plan to do next? Hmm? Perhaps a nice vacation in Dragon Shores? Hmm? <laughs> You're a real comedian sometimes, Bentley. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
You know, I still have to find the rest of the dragon eggs. Plus, Hunter seems to have disappeared again, so I should go make sure he's not in more trouble. You haven't seen him, have you? Huh? Me? Oh, no, no. If I do happen to encounter him, however, I will most certainly inform you immediately. It's a funny thing, Spyro. I adjusted Avalar's portals to take me to the Dragon Worlds, but somehow I ended up here. Maybe my coordinate tables are out of date. By a thousand years. That would explain why the book was so cheap. So, now that you're done saving the world again, are you gonna visit me in Avalar? Sure, Alora, but I still have to find the rest of the eggs and, well, Hunter's disappeared again. Did you say, Hunter? Well, hey, I can help. I just saw him sneak off with... Uh, uh, -huh. uh Agent Nine, isn't that a Rhinoc over in those bushes? A uh, Rhinoc! Ooh, let me at him. You want a piece of me, Rhinoc boy? Eat laser punk! Come on now, no fair hiding. Uh, I'm sure Hunter is in good hands. But I mean, I'm sure he will turn up soon. I promise you'll come visit Avalar soon, okay? Now how many times have I told you not to tease that moose? It was Billy's idea! Uh, yeah, yeah! <laughs> Is that true, Billy? <laughs> Hold that thought, Billy. Spyro, great to see ya! Hi, Sheila. I've been looking for Hunter all day. Have you seen him? <laughs> Sorry, Spyro. Hunter made me promise not to tell you where they went. Say? <laughs> you didn't hear anything from me. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. It's a sad sight, Sparks. Another noble warrior falls victim to the plague of love. Just look away. Well, I guess we'll have to find the rest of the eggs by ourselves. Come on, Spyro. Take a little break. Let's watch the show. We don't have that many eggs left to find. Only two. Technically three. But you didn't hear it from me. Yeah, you see why the Sorceress isn't nearly as good as the Ripto fight? I mean, she only has one form. Like, <laughs> Ripto was an awesome boss that had, like, three freaking forms that you had to fight through, but the Sorceress is just this really short one-form battle. The battle itself isn't even that impressive. I say the only good thing about it probably is the music.
so kind of a weak end to an amazing trilogy of games, but the game itself is still amazing, though. Man, you know, I really wish that uh, they would remaster um, the Spyro trilogy for PS4, like, like they do the, the, the Crash trilogy. That would be awesome. Like, seriously, I really, really hope they do that. <laughs> if they do that, then I would be getting that in an instant. Like, you know, since Crash and Spyro are owned by Activision nowadays, like, normally I'd say, like, I don't even want them, like, messing with it at this point, but I don't know. I mean, I know Activision didn't make the Crash remakes. I, I forget who made the Crash remakes. Like, I I'm not sure what company did that, but, yeah, I'll have to look that up a little later. Well, actually, I might as well look it up right now. I mean, I'm just sitting here watching credits. Okay, the Crash remakes were made by... Ah, oh yeah, the Insane Trilogy. Oh yeah, Vicarious Visions. They, they were, they're the ones that are remaking it. I believe they're also the ones that uh, made the GBA Crash Bandicoot games. Those were pretty good. But yeah, it's like, if a developer, preferably in Zomniac, like, you know, if Activision, like, uh, you know, uh, went to Insomniac to, like, remake the trilogy, that would be amazing. But I would want it to be, like, for those of you who don't know what the cra the Insane Trilogy is like, it's basically, it's the kind of remake slash remaster that everybody wants. Like, it, it's not just like an upscaling of the original game, it's like a ground-up remake, and it's like fully done with like PS4 level visuals and stuff but the level and the levels and the gameplay are exactly the same though it's got the same level design the same gameplay that everybody loved like they didn't actually change anything about the game it's just the same game but with much 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 better visuals and that's what i would want them to do with this game like or these games rather like the three ps1 spyro games like i'd love to see them completely remade with brand new visuals but you know, like, brand new visuals, but keep the gameplay exactly the same. Like, the same collectathon gameplay that we all love. I just, I often imagine how incredible um, some of the worlds in the Spyro games would look if they were completely redone with the PS4's power. Like, it would be phenomenal. I don't know, I mean, if it can happen to Crash, then, hey, maybe it can happen to Spyro. I mean, I don't think, you know, like, like I don't think there's no chance that the Spyro trilogy could get a remake just like the original Crash trilogy. I mean, that'd be so awesome, and... The idea that it might actually be a possibility just... Oh man, it fills me with hope. Anyway... Remember how there was one more egg here that we couldn't get before? Oh good, I got all the skill points. Okay, well, let's look at this first. Oh wait, I missed one of the skill points? Wait, what did I miss? I missed a skill point and lost fle- wait, what did I- I'm confused. Hold on a sec, I have to look this up real quick. I, it probably involves the race with the Rhinox, but, oh no, um, what the heck did I miss? Wait, there's not even a... 
Huh? Okay, five there. Oh, yeah, I was right. Okay, the course record for Lost Fleet. I didn't do that. Um. Well, right now, um, something else requires our attention. Also, actually, let's go ahead and look at the epilogue. It's like the Spyro 2 epilogue. Karma, money bags. Karma. Speaking of money bags, hmm. Now where is he? I think that bear should be around here somewhere. Ah, there he is. Don't worry, Spyro. I won't be needing any more of your money. Now, now, don't look so surprised. I found one of the dragon eggs, and I'm going to sell it for a fortune back in Avalar. Uh, uh-oh. Uh, why are you looking at me like that? I, uh, uh, I, I've got to be going now. Uh, toodles! This is the part that we have all been waiting for! Give me back all of my gems that you stole from me, you fat bear! Yeah, and hand over that dragon egg, too, while you're at it. <laughs> Money bags, the real final boss of Year of the Dragon. <laughs> drat. Double drat. Drat, 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 drat. Oh, I never knew dragons were so fast. That's it, I give up. I'm retiring to Spooky Swamp to become a haiku poet. He says as he runs into Crystal Islands. Oh, man, I am so glad they let you do that. All throughout the game, it's like every one of the other characters gets a shot at money bags when you free them, but then in the very end, you finally get to, like, get a shot at him yourself. Anyway, with that done and out of the way, I'm going to go back to Lost Fleet. I'm going to get that skill point real quick. Then we'll come back and do the final Sparks level. Spyro!
Now that the Rhino- Oh, we got it! Cool! Alright, that is every skill point in the game, though I guess you don't get anything for getting all skill points unless it adds something new to the epilogue? Oh. Wait, was this available before? <laughs> yeah, Ripto's still alive. So is Nasty Nork. I know Nasty Nork comes back in a hero's tale. Huh. I guess those I guess those got added in after I got all the skill points. Okay, so you can only view like half of the epilogue unless you have all the skill points. Well, time to go do the final sparks level. <laughs>